Vivek Ramaswamy expresses concern about the next six to seven months and says the U.S. is entering a dangerous time similar to after the 9-11 attacks, potential threat of illegal immigrants. Vivek, this really is not surprising. What's surprising, I think, is that we haven't had a major terror attack in the last three and a half years, but this is inevitable, is it not? I'm worried about the next six to seven months, Laura. We are entering one of the more dangerous periods that we've entered since 9-11, since in my lifetime in this country. And I'll tell you this, just do the basic math. If there are upwards of 20 million illegals in this country right now, and that may be a conservative estimate, even if 99 out of 100 came with good intentions, that's generous. That's 1%. That's talking about hundreds of thousands of people who are here with ill intentions. That's dangerous. And I worry about what this country holds in store unless we change leadership and actually start these mass deportations and fix that border crisis now. The call for strict immigration policies often centers on prioritizing national security, aiming to shield the country from potential dangers. Vivek Ramaswamy's comments highlight significant worries about national security and underline the critical need to tackle illegal immigration. Advocates for mass deportation and resolving the border crisis echo conservative values, emphasizing the necessity of maintaining secure borders and enforcing robust immigration controls to avert potential threats. Strong, proactive leadership is crucial in managing national security issues. The current administration's focus on immigration and border security underscores the need for swift, decisive measures to reduce potential risks. Effective governance is believed to involve anticipating and preventing security threats, rather than merely reacting after a crisis occurs.